How's it going everyone? Captain Collier here. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time tuning in, my name is Brandon. I fish here along the Alabama Gulf Coast for just about anything and everything. And I do also run a few charters as well. Today, I'm just on the boat getting ready for a charter I have tomorrow, just kind of getting all the rigs and tackle and stuff set up. It's blowing right now, so fishing wouldn't be too great right now anyways. But today's video, we're gonna be going back to when I had my sea hunt a couple months ago before I got this blackjack and I was fishing a sheep's head tournament that went on for three months, the Convict Classic Tournament. And uh, I fished it for probably five or six times. It was basically just uh, you take pictures of the fish that you catch, put them on a measuring board, and you submit them to the Fish and Chaos app that way. So throughout the video, you'll probably see me measuring fish, and I do have ugly written on my hands, and that's just so you can submit that fish. That was the, the code that you had to use. But that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna roll through that video, and at the end of this video, I'm gonna show you a pretty cool prize that I ended up getting, and uh, a couple other things as well. So I hope y'all enjoy the video. If you do, please give me a thumbs up. Consider subscribing if you do enjoy it. Let's get it. All right, y'all, we have made a slight half mile move at a pretty decent sized rig now. I call this the Hulk rig. It's because it's green and it's big. But y'all check out the screen right here. 52 foot of water, 71 degree water temperatures, and it's just sheep's head and probably red snapper just all throughout the water column right here. We actually done caught two or three right here. We're getting low on crabs, so we're going to shrimp now. So we are catching a few mangroves and uh, I'm sure we'll catch some red snapper as well. But the sheep's head are plentiful. I know we're gonna get a sheep on that guy. What you got, Cody? Oh, get that baby in here. Give him the old yeet or the, uh, the break off. Mm. A little smaller at this one. I say that, they, they look small until you get them in a boat. We'll measure him, right? Got the girth, but just not the length. Get you back in the water. Quab. It's a little appetizer. Boom. Ooh. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. I gotta get him out of that structure. That's a good one, Cody, get the net. I know I've, I know I about knocked you over. But I felt him go into that structure. I had to pull his head away. No, I just saw that rod tip at my <laughs> this has got some weight on the heavier setup. Hopefully, he stays pinned. Come on. He's 20. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, baby. Woo! Another good one. This one almost got me. Barely hooked. Cody, look at this hook set. Son. Right out. All right, come on. Let's get you out. Get you on this board. Just chill out. Don't no need to no need to make a big scene. You go. On. Don't don't do it. No. Ah! All right. What you measure, girl? Twenty-two. Bye bye. That was just on the tiniest of the crabs, too. Little baby. Ooh, look at that. He almost got me. I'm gonna have to tie, retie. Yeater. A yeater sheeper. <laughs> All right, we got us a fresh leader on that last sheep. Frayed me up pretty well. I'm really surprised he didn't break me. But I mean, it's so many fish out here. It's it's crazy. 
about out alive crab. Pretty decent. She is fighting, that's for sure. Pulling some drag. Yo! <laughs> Just needed a 20! <laughs> I knew you had the net ready, so I got I had to give it a try. <laughs> Woo! Let's go, baby. Another one. Would you calm down? I'm gonna throw you back. I promise. I promise. I will. You're very lucky. Now look at the colors on that fish. Gotta love them. Got some purple to it, some silver. Man, such a fun fight. Great eating too. 21 and a half. Oh yeah, show us your eating skills. Yeet! I wonder what's going through their minds. You know, you just see this crab just pop up out of nowhere. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. And they just get ripped up out of the water. Just imagine what's going through the crab's mind. <laughs> <laughs> he's getting, he's getting, he's getting yeah, he's going through it. For a good cause though. Circle of life. Boom! Did we just double up? Yep. Okay, mine's all right. Oh, I thought you said that was a good one. He hit it like a freaking Gosh! I left my hook in the water. And it just got hit? <laughs> a bear hook? Yes! Almost lost another pole. <laughs> I would have been royally pissed. <laughs> Four ounce bait fish throwing the pole. Mm. Almost pulled me in. Yep, he's up in the rig too. Not really. He is a fighter though. Okay, he's decent. I'll net him. Yeah, he's definitely decent. As y'all can see, always tons of fun out there getting on some sheep's head, nonstop action. A lot of big fish, a lot of fish between 20, 22 inches to the fork. I didn't end up getting the lunker. I think someone else got that one at like 24 inches total length, which is a massive sheep's head. Uh, I couldn't quite get one that long, but I did end up winning three different categories. Uh, I don't really remember what they all were, but basically like the top 50 fish, top 10 longest fish for an influencer, which is myself, I consider. And this is one of the prizes that I won. This is a sheep's head that is wood burned by Alabama Burning. You can find them on Instagram and Facebook. I'll have him linked down in the description. But what a cool little trophy right there. Uh, my wife is really gonna love me putting this up in the living room, but it is too cool not to show off. And I don't know if y'all can see on the GoPro, it's got like a little gold tooth right there. That's just the icing on the cake. As you can see on the back there, it says Alabama Burning. And I believe there's only two people in the whole country that do this kind of work right here. So if y'all inter are interested in 
you know, getting one of these made of a fish that you catch or just a fish to hang up somewhere, I would highly recommend it. And uh, also did end up getting some cash and some other various prizes as well. But that's gonna be it for this video. Uh, this tournament is gonna go on again next year. Anybody can fish it all over around the uh, country or possibly the world. I'm not sure where all sheep's head are but it's gonna be going from January 1st to the end of March. So it should be a good time. And I'll probably be posting some sheep's head videos leading up to it. I can't wait for sheep's head season to start. And if y'all are interested in booking a charter with me to get on some sheep's head, that's my favorite fish to target and catch. So y'all can check me out on the Fishing Chaos app down in the description below. I'll have my calendar down there. But that's gonna be it for the video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. We'll see you out on the next one.